Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. My name is Nuology. Today I have a Steam Deck tips and trick video for you all. If you want to play more unsupported games on your Steam Deck device, all you have to do is do the simple trick I'll be showing you guys here in this video. But before I get into it, of course, if this video does go on to help you out, make sure you drop a big thumbs up on it. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Turn on the post notification bell as well so this way you don't miss a notification from me ever again. And without further ado guys, let's get into talking about this. So game Games like WWE 2K22, uh, this will be very beneficial using this method, and I'm sure there's a lot of other games too. Now, there is certain unsupported games that will not work using this method. Like, for example, you still won't be able to play Warzone because basically uh, with the Linux operating system um, and the anti-cheat measure that this game uses, it basically thinks you're cheating or whatever, so that's why you can't play this. But games like 2K22 that actually work, but just deal with the issue of actually crashing, and I'm sure there's a lot Lot of other unsupported games or they claim it's unsupported because they crash um, there's actually a good workaround for this and I'm gonna show you guys right now how to do it so you're gonna want to click the Steam button here and it's gonna pull up this menu you're gonna want to scroll all the way down to where it says settings I'm trying to do this with one hand and then basically once you're in the settings you just want to go down to where it says internet and then you accept that and then you go to offline mode it says enter offline mode obviously you just hit a on that and then it will say enter offline mode you just want to confirm that and now you're disconnected from the internet and I don't know why this actually fixes, you know, certain games, but for example, 2K22 used to crash like heck when I was online. Soon as I did the offline mode method, the game ran perfectly fine. I didn't get a single crash. So this is something you definitely want to experiment with. If there's a game that you think could work or maybe just crashes a lot and you're just, you know, desperately trying to get the game to work, try going into offline mode and see if that actually fixes the issue. Because like I said, it did fix the issue for me for WWE 2K22. 22. I no longer experience any crashes or anything like that. Um, like I said, it's not going to work for everything. You know, games where there's like a cheat engine or an anti-cheat thing, you know, sometimes it's going to think like you're cheating if you're using the Linux operating system. So, you know, games like that, there's no hope for it. You have to basically just switch to Windows and, you know, play it that way. But for games like this that are just crashing, like 2K22, literally just enter offline mode and you're good to go. You will not crash anymore. So definitely give this a try with some of your favorite games that you know, are just crashing on your device, but you think there's hope for them, this method might actually fix that. So, uh, you know, once again, guys, if this video did go on to help you, make sure you drop a big thumbs up on it. Subscribe if you're new. Turn the post notification bell on. Leave me a comment down below if this actually fixed your issue with one of your games you were trying to get to work. And uh, that's basically it, guys. Take care and see you guys later.